So recently, I found many of you said this video is misleading. This is just a meme build that you should not take it seriously. But before that, let me explain something about this topic. Same as the most people who mains Hu Tao, I also got her in the first day of her banner. I was main Razor back then, and I pulled her. In the first time, I was confused how to play her so I moved my Razor set to her and... It was fast. Then I searching on Google, and I found that she is an elemental TPS. So I grinded her set from end of 1.3 and finished in 1.6. I started to use manual guide on YouTube that Hu Tao is paired with Sing Chiu. Flavorized Team Calm was insanely good. Then I finished my Kazuha build, and I found that his support ability is kinda broken. And I remember that C6 Bennett also increasing pyro damage. So why don't I try this build? Back in 2 months ago, I made my first video and this team play is so fun and cool. Then 2.0 is announced, so I found this new domain that contains Shimenawa Reminiscence. Miraculously, this Shimenawa set has the same stat with my Crimson Witch set. Then I started a guide on YouTube uh, comparing Vaporize Team Comp and Raw Pyro Team Comp. And I think Pyro Team Comp is slightly better. So the question is, why this team so good for me? Let's start with the base. Bennett. Since my Bennett is C6, I can use him to fill two Pyro characters in my party. So 25% attack is added as Pyro Resonance status. When he proceeds Elemental Burst, he provides 15% Pyro damage bonus to all melee characters, plus 700 to 900 flat attack. Bennett, Hu Tao, Kazuha, Zhongli, all of them are melee characters. And then we have Kazuha. Viridescent Fener Kazuha can decrease 40% enemy elemental resistance for 10 seconds, and if you build him with much elemental mastery, he will give elemental damage bonus to his party according to the elementals he swirl for 8 seconds. And then we have Zhongli. Zhongli is a shielder, support, and sub TPS too. His jet shield decreases all enemy elemental resistance for 20%. And while he using Archaic Petra sets, he can provide extra 35% elemental damage bonus while he picking up the elemental shot for 10 seconds to all his party members. How this team comes works. First, Pyro application of Bennett and Kazuha. Two, Zhongli pick up the shards. And then, Hotel start goes. Sayonara. Actually, you don't need to use Bennett burst if your HP is not under 20%. But what if your Hu Tao has more than 50%? She would lose half of her DPS. It's not even half, it's just 33%. That's why we have Zhongli here. When Zhongli picks up the elemental shard, all of his party members gain extra 35% damage bonus based on the shard he picks. Since this team has only Pyro, then only Pyro shards appears. Bennett needs Pyro, Kazuha plunge convert into Pyro, and Hu Tao is Pyro too. All of them is provided. But what if you want to keep Sinchu? Okay, first, you need to get Crimson Witch set for extra damage reaction. And I tell you, that Crimson Witch domain is a true nightmare. <laughs> 2. Your Archive Petro Zhongli produce shot of Hydro, seeing Sinchu Rain Sword come first. 3. If you put Kazuha, Kazuha would likely swirl the Hydro since you don't have any Pyro enabler there. Why don't you use Kazuha, Bennett, Shinchu, and Hu Tao? Playing Hu Tao is a bit risky, so I recommend you to use shielder such Diana, Noel, or Zhongli. And why don't you use Bennett, Shinchu, Hu Tao, and Zhongli? She will overheal. Hu Tao burst, heal her HP. Shinchu cast E, heal her HP. Bennett Burst, also heal our HP. Why don't you use Sinchu, Hu Tao, Zhongli, Kazuha? This one is good, but Kazuha often is rolled to Hydro that your Hu Tao likely not gonna love it. Better to switch Sinchu, Hu Tao, Sucrose, and Zhongli, since Sucrose increased 20% of her elemental mastery to her party member. Hu Tao, Sinchu, they can deal a bigger number, but hey. What about C0 Hu Tao? Her charge attack consumes stamina, and her normal attack has internal cooldown. If you don't land a reaction, you will lose some of your overall damage. So, which one is better you think? 
And anyway, thanks for watching this video. I'm here just to share my idea. You may like it or not, but I hope this is gonna be helpful. And I'll see you in the next video.